Welcome to Plant Revelations and today I want to talk to you about daffodils flowering in January. Should you be worried? Is it climate change gone mad? Is the planet going to turn into a ball of fire? Are we all going to die a slow and painful death? Probably yes, but not today and there's nothing we need to worry about in the short term future. Now climate change is a real thing and it's definitely happening but daffodils flowering in January is not a sign that climate change has gone accelerated and gone mad uh, and it's not a good way to monitor the warming of the planet. And that's because there are hundreds of different types of daffodils, lots of different species and many of them, and some of them have been bred to flower at all different times. This one here is called Regifold's Early Sensation, which flowers in December, January. And there are actually daffodils that will flower as late as May. So if you see a yellow daffodil, and just you just assume it's the regular daffodil, and you see it flowering in January, it's probably a special variety that is meant to flower at this time of year. Now this is another early flowering variety called Spring Dawn, which is one of my favourites. And this also has been bred to flower in January. So again, it's not a good sign of uh, tracking climate change. But it does look very similar to our native daffodil, which is the Lenten lily, which is a really good sign and a good plant to monitor to see how climate change has happened. And that not, that that daffodil is called Narcissus, Pseudonarcissus lobularis. And the reason that's a good daffodil to use as a marker of climate change is because it's a native plant which Lots of poets and writers have written about uh, going back the last sort of four or five hundred years. It's been documented when it flowers and people write it down in their diaries when they've seen that native daffodil flowering. So we can use that as a marker to say how much it has warmed. And certainly in the past they were flowering in April and nowadays they do sometimes flower at end of February, March. So we definitely know that climate change is happening, it's warming and that's a really good species to use. Not the daffodils in the garden. Anyway, I hope that's made that up and you found it interesting. Please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.